everybody, this is Suravi Padesh, yeah? Yes, correct. First of all, is everyone okay? Everyone is good in your family? Yes. Um, we're all doing well. Uh, staying in, staying safe. Yeah, yeah. Doing best we can, thank you. And you play with your sons, uh, yeah. I guess, regularly. And so we're going to broadcast your uh, the show that you did in a couple of years back. A couple of years back. Yeah, that, that's so nice of you. Thank you. Yeah, and we're going to do that uh, on August 21st. And so this is a special, I guess it's a special time in the calendar. Um, explain to me a little bit what it is and what the significance of it uh, culturally. Well, it's um, around this time, the, the date falls on a different date every year, but it's considered to be the birth of uh, the deity we call Ganesh. Uh, he's the bestower of wisdom and intellect. And it is said that this is the time that uh, he appeared in the universe. He came to earth. And so we have a big festival celebrating that. So it's religious, it's social, it's cultural. It's, um, and it goes on for 10 days. And um, it, it is a big event and it's grown across the world um, with uh, Hindus all over the world now. Now we're also connected. Um, and it's, uh, it's a time of, you know, celebration, rejoicing, uh, a time of introspection because, you know, we, we always pray for wisdom and, and and intellect and and the time of year is actually very important because it precedes a time a fortnight where the the earth is changing the, the a lot of change is going on so there's a period after the celebration where we actually um don't have any major festivals or prayers or anything and then after that then that's a whole other <laughs> <laughs> set of festivals yes yeah so a 10 day long festival i assume that there's many different activities like it's it that's why it's such a um it, it goes beyond religion and it, it goes like it deep into the culture because you know obviously when yes. it goes over several days like that as a community you're gonna there are a lot of events yeah. are happen. And, yes yes you're correct and it is actually um a large community event even though people do their worship in their homes but um, usually and under usual circumstances yes. in in the temples and, and large community gatherings so there's a uh, you know lots of music and fun and and um, it, it's really a great time excellent excellent so let's just talk a little bit about the music that people are gonna hear on August 21st, uh, if they watch the concert, which I hope they will. Um, <laughs> I hope but, so, too. So let's, let's see, explain to us a little bit like what people can expect. Well, it's um, North Indian classical music and, and most of it is uh, the, we also have some semi-classical pieces in there. It's um, like any classical music performance in Indian music, it's, it's really a little bit of an adventure. Um, all of the improvisations that we play are pretty much on the spot. And um, so it's like a journey you take with us that we've explored our pieces, explored our improvisations and just kind of interact with each other and have fun. And, and we did have a lot of fun that night. We enjoyed being at Timakwaha very much. Thank you very much. Uh, now, I also have experience playing with my children and my family, you know, and uh, there's something um, very uh, special because obviously communication is very easy and a, a lot yes. of things are understood to begin with. But what a lot of people don't realize is as a parent, it's also, for me, it's always been very difficult to play my best when I'm playing with my children because I'm all constantly playing for them in my mind like because i want them to play well and to succeed and and like i'm very in tune with what they're doing to the point where 
I forget about what I'm supposed to do, basically. Like, and you know what I mean? Like, it's yes, that cool. happens a lot. <laughs> yeah, it's it, and and so I'm I'm happy to know that I'm not the only one who feels like that. No, no, it's um, and uh, with me actually, it's uh, it's it's become a little different in that I enjoy their music so much that oftentimes I forget that oh, I have to play too, yeah. and <laughs> I like listening to them so much. Um, but initially, yes, it used to be, it, it, it still is to a certain extent. It's like, you're so, okay, um, it, it needs to go a certain way. It has to go in, in let, let's see what they do. And, um, but now it's, I sometimes prefer to just hear them. Yeah, I, I enjoy hearing my kids too, but like a lot of, especially when they were younger, like yeah. now it's, it, you know, they basically, they all play better than me. So it's fine, you know. But, yeah, I but think when, I'm getting there too. <laughs> yeah. But when they were young, you know, it was like I was like willing them <laughs> in my mind, you know, yes. to play their best, you know, and that it's very draining. It's very hard. So uh, yeah, it, but Definitely. I think there's always been something special. I know that we have um, had the uh, like uh, an added. There's an added power to the music when it comes from a family, for a lot of people. And so, and we witnessed that. I witnessed it when I was filming your, your concert. And uh, I know for a fact that, you know, people have told us over the years, because, you know, the kids, they used to open every concert for 15 years. And so every style of music, you know, they played right. in music too. And uh, oh, you know, nice. yeah, with, with, uh, Sun, uh, uh, with Nandu. Uh, Nan Nandu yes, oh. yes, yes. So, um, you know, because like in the old house, like years ago, they were little and so we opened for one of his concerts and oh, nice. at least twice maybe at least twice and so you know where i tried to of course it was a a little bit of a like the blind leading the blind but you know i <laughs> but yeah. trying to make it sound interesting and and you know somewhat like uh within the style of, of and the sound of the music you know so yeah. anyways uh, i very much appreciate you talking to me um, and, oh, no. and I hope you have a great festival. What's the oh, festival thank you called? So much. Uh, Ganesh Utsav. Fe so, Utsav means festival. Festival. So it's the festival of Ganesh. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. Perfect. Well, have a good, great festival. And uh, maybe um, when when the, the if you go on you on Facebook, um, yeah. while the uh, and on YouTube, I think there's a chat too. But I think like the, I know that there are a few concerts where the um, the performers they were chatting with the audience, you know, answering questions and things. So yes. feel free to do that if uh, if if it. Oh, if, okay. Yeah, that would be lovely. And thank you so much for um, having us and rebroadcasting. And you know, we really love the work that you do. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> See okay, you soon. Thank you. <laughs> Take care. Okay. You you too. Okay, bye-bye.